What's up, fam? I'm DJ King One One Games here, back again with a brand new video, and I haven't said that in a while, and I really apologise for that. I tried to make it come up to YouTube, and I don't, haven't really had any excuses because I've been on my summer holidays. Um, but I have had a good reason why I haven't been uploading for a while, and it is what it is. Um, I'll do a proper video. I keep saying that. I, I really keep saying that, but. Yeah, it, it like it is what it is. I'm not doing this professionally. Um, it's just kind of on my accords. It really shouldn't be, but you know. So the whole purpose of this video is I'm going to be showing you my very own Rick Grimes uh, online character from The Walking Dead within GTA 5. I'm in direct mode because with direct mode you can be invincible. And you can just do all sorts of really fun. I love the the mode. Um, I ha I'm not going to bother doing any casino gameplay because I know that's just come out the Diamond Casino update, which looks pretty cool. Uh, I was in the casino before, but I really just don't want to mess around in the casino. I just want to show you my Rick Grimes uh, custom. Um, he doesn't look. I actually did this video a while ago. I even did a video talking about the Walking Dead season 10 trailer, but I just never uploaded it, which. I don't think I'm going to because that was two about, about two weeks ago now, so a bit out of date. But uh, this is my Rick Grimes um, cre character uh, from GTA. I made him as my second character from GTA Online. I love it. I really do. I love this character so much. I think he's very he's a very fun. Yeah, as you can see, I enabled online, so or well, not online. I enabled invincibility so I don't have this issue of dying and then going back to the trailer and then all sorts. I might take him into online just to kind of um, show him out a bit, but I won't be in this video. Maybe if I do another GTA 5 video, which is actually kind of weird because GTA was the first thing I've uploaded, but not online. <laughs> anyway, back to it. Um, Rick, what I did for him was I gave him the scruffy beard and the slick back hairstyle which you can't see because of this brown cowboy hat which is meant to resemble the sheriff hat he wears in season 1 uh, and so season 2 but then he passes on to Carl Grimes, his son, who then dies in season 8 and then is passed on to Judith Grimes, Rick's surrogate. Well, I. Rick's daughter, however, Shane Walsh is the biological father. A little uh, Walking Dead trivia for you. Um, but yes, Rick can't do this in the show. Can't do Super Jump, but I just enable it anyway, because why not? We're in direct mode. Um, what I went for was a cross between Season 1 and Season 9. Hence why Rick is... He has... Well, it's kind of... Actually, it's a more of an amalgamation of all seasons. I couldn't find a... My base idea was to go for a hairstyle that much resembled Season 9. Uh, which is... I'm going to have to get someone to punch me in the face now to knock this hat off. Um, it's all good. I ain't got time for this. Okay, and I just runs off like a, like a coward. <laughs> oh, well. Um, well let's see if this really doesn't help, doesn't it? Okay. I went for the slick back hairstyle, which is very much... Season, um, season one, no, season, well, season three to, three to eight, there you go, now you can see, um, Rick had longer hair from season three, and then up to season eight, and then, the, of course he cut it from season nine, because I was going for the beige, uh, lime, the beige, lime, yellow, shirt which much resembled not only his season 9 shirt but his season 1 sheriff costume and sheriff suit um I, w I wanted to go for that hairstyle because it kind of looked a bit more accurate but i thought uh it's the best you're gonna get um also i wish the top button was not done up which unfortunately it is gta 5 doesn't have as much customization as red dead redemption does I think Red Dead Redemption will be a much better game in order in order of making Rick. From the I've watched many what uh, Red Dead Redemption Rick customs and many GTA Rick customs, and they just the Red Dead ones are far more accurate. There's far more 
uh, customization options. The shirt, to be honest, isn't exactly accurate because oh, not only is the top button done up oh, and the no. sleeves, they are they have the button which helps to roll them up. Rick doesn't use that. He doesn't have a shirt with that. Also, the the color is slightly off. Rick's shirt is much more beige, and it's a bit, you know. But it is what it is. I like it. I went for the brown pants instead of the bluish grey ones because, well, to be honest, they're the only ones I could find that truly look somewhat like what Rick would wear. But it also reminded me of a picture. Um, I, ha I saved it on my phone because for some reason it was my uh, my home screen for a while. But it was a picture of Rick with um, the beige shirt and brown uniform style uh, chinos. Which he never actually wore in uh, any of his episodes in season nine, but oh well, I thought it looked kind of smart, so I thought I'd stick it on um, Rick here. I went for some brown boots because, of course, Rick wears the the sheriff boots uh, all the from season one, episode one, all the way up until his exit in season nine, episode five, which for me was just a brilliant like. Little Easter egg, and that's going to stick with him in the Rick Grimes movies as well, unless the CRM uh, provide him uh, some new new shoes. Which, in all fairness, he's probably going to need because I don't think shoes can last about five years on the on the dot, or five to ten years. I don't know how long the current timeline is. But never mind. Um, yeah, I think one of the things I really like the most about this, uh, about this character or this uh, version of Rick that I've done, is that he is very much an amalgamation of all the seasons. He's got a season nine uh, fashion style with the beige, well, not well, it's supposed to be beige, but you know, yellow style shirt and the brown uh, brown pants even though it doesn't wear them so it's more season one that but season nine shirt season one pants season three and four three up to eight hairstyle uh season i say season seven and eight beard we can't get the psycho murder beard that he has in season five and yeah we can't get that obviously which I'm quite gutted about because that is my favourite, um, apart from season 9, that is my favourite appearance of Rick. That is my favourite version of, him, of the character, where he has the, the long scruffy hair and he has the big bushy beard. And I, I, I just looks, it looks menacing and it looks crazy, which I love. You know, The Walking Dead. You're not meant to look smart. You're not meant to look presentable. You're in it. You're in it to survive. It's a survival series. Well, it used to be, of course. But yeah, it's not about looking smart. I ain't afraid of you. It's yeah. I, I like how this one. It's not a, a set oh, season Jesus. Rick. Which for me is it for anyone who wants to make this. It is very. Um, uh, leany, it, it gives a lot of leeway. You, you don't have to be dead on. It just kind of looks like Rick. And also add the sheriff hat, which you see me had before. But of course, after get punched in the face once or hit by a car, it just comes off. And in direct mode, you can't pick it back. It could pick it back up again, unless there's a um, unless there is a mode where you can. But I don't really want to faff around. Um, anyway, that is my Rick Grimes. Uh, that is my Rick Grimes thing. I don't know. Uh, in fact, I'm going. I'm what I'm going to do. I'm going to pause the video right here, and I'm going to go to online mode. I'm going to set up a solo session, and I'm going to. I'm going to show some of the other costume variants you can get for Rick. So I shall be back in a second. Okay, so we are back and now other
clove variations you could go for. Um, as you can see, I've gone for the lemon tucked here, which is, like I said before, slightly inaccurate. Um, I think there are other. Uh, it's not. It's not exactly the shade of beige that Rick wears in season nine before he takes his exit, but other variations here could could consist of this navy tucked which is a bit like what he wears in season 8 which is the more all out war uh, which is the all out war season um, as a bit of a light shade, a bit of a too dark shade of um, blue but he does wear blue especially in the fight with Negan at the very end where he slits his throat bit too dark but it you know it might do this a shade a bit like this would um would be a bit more beneficial if it was tucked also one advantage on this is it has the top button undone which is very it's a bit more accurate to rick ah oh, there you go perfect uh, okay. perfect blue tucked this is the shirt that rick would wear uh in season seven and season eight especially to more war towards the end of season eight and at the start of season eight rick wears this um it's quite hard to t I, mu I must be colorblind or something because I, I can't quite tell what shade it is it looks to be from some angles it's green uh not that green though but from other angles it's more ash cool. i'm gonna say it's more ash just because it's very rugged it's very dirty It'll make sense for it to look a bit more of a, um, a neutral color, like ash. Uh, and you got the yeah. None of these are really accurate, to be honest. But a shirt like that, but tucked, would be perfect. Actually, keep that in mind, and then we'll go to the lemon. Hmm. I'm not sure, but the the butter uh, untucked um, w that one would be perfect for season nine. However, you'd have to tuck the shirt in and roll up the sleeves, but that does look relatively accurate. I don't play GTA much, so of course I'm not really going to see. Oh, you're up looking for stuff. Um, we'll go for some. Uh, we'll go for the all out war um, look which means uh, oh this shirt would work quite well I'm gonna go with this shirt more than the one I just selected before I only just found that it looks really accurate so yeah we'll go for that one and then we'll go for pants oh wait yeah. might as well go on the same uh, it should be oh I know these are tops never mind um, Pants and Rick in season season eight and season seven, I believe. Yeah, he goes for more um goes for more casual coloured pants. Like you, not anything like this. Oh my god, um something a bit more blue, not it's like a dark blue. If we can find it, I don't want baggy uh, chinos. Have a look here. Eh, I can't quite find it. Uh, utility? Ah, no. No chance. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, uh, go for jeans. Okay, um, I think, yeah, something like this, really. Um, another slight inaccuracy is the belt. Rick, of course, he holds a he holds many different. Um, Rick uses many different uh, items, such as his iconic revolver, uh, the hatchet, which he gets in season six, uh, or yeah, the the Colt Python, the hatchet. I think he does have some radio walkie-talkies in there as well. But of course, Rick 
uh, in GTA, we can't really carry all of that. I think, personally, lose the heart. We've made we've just made quite a solid season eight Rick. That is a very good season eight variant of Rick Grimes, which I know for a lot of people, season eight is considered to be the worst season. But for me, I really like season eight because it was it it kept you on your feet. It was action left, right, and center. I thought overall it's a very strong and impactful season, and I think I'm. I, Comments are going to hate me for this. I will admit the writing was bad, and the, the decision of killing off Carl was awful. I hated how they killed off Carl, and I also hated how they kind of portrayed Rick as a bit weaker in season eight, uh, mainly towards Negan and Daryl, which made no sense because he kicked the um, a savior's ass. He beat up um, Jadis's people. It was a tough nut, but when it came to Negan, he got his backside beating which made little sense but I think that's going to conclude it for this video not some customization options for Rick Grimes uh, how to make season 7 or season 8 and also how to make oh yeah ditch the cowboy hat as well he doesn't wear that in season 8 he looks at it after Carl dies but <laughs> that's it um, the murder coat is not an option unfortunately you can get a very inaccurate one Something that Jughead Jones from Riverdale would wear, but nothing that matches Rick's murder coat. Uh, but yeah, so that's going to conclude it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I hope to see you guys again soon because I do miss uploading. And yeah, anyway, that's it. I'll see you guys later.